Hi everybody, we're at John Satter's Auto Repair. We have a 2003 Pontiac Grand Prix with a 3.8 liter engine. The customer's complaint is he smelled fuel when he turned the heater blower motor on. So we removed the cover underneath the hood, has, a, has an engine protection cover, and I saw this extra crease in here, it doesn't belong here, and it smells like gasoline. Then we went down here, and you can see right here is what your fuel line's supposed to look like. You can come around here to the front. And this is what your fuel line's supposed to look like. It's supposed to have a nice bend. It's supposed to look just like this. Someone's cut his fuel line here, put these clamps on here, and this clamp is so big in the back here, his fuel line is just, is just slopping around there. So when you cycle the key off and on, this, is, this has got like 40 pounds per square inch of pressure. So I'm gonna cycle the key and you can watch this whole thing flex. <clears throat> So with that whole thing flexing like that, and you got, what'll happen is the gasolines, you get all kinds of wet spots down here. You can smell fuel everywhere in here. And the way that these clamps are on here, it's supposed to be another plastic line with this elbow fitting. It's not supposed to have just a hose shoved on there. This is just a, um, a regular fuel line that's made for about 15 pounds uh, pressure. And the way that this clamp is, you can see how many threads is on that clamp. That's crazy. This thing should not wobble around like that. It should have that crimp on push connector. So we ordered Dorman makes a repair kit for it. We're gonna put it back to factory. We're gonna put it just like this. So I just wanna give you a little tip from John Sanders. When you have a customer complain they smell fuel, please open the hood. As soon as I opened the hood, I smelled the fuel. I removed that cover and I saw that. I said, oh my God. Cause that keeps leaking like that. You're gonna catch the car on fire. It's gonna burn down before anyone comes to help you. So when you have a fuel smell problem, address that issue right away. Have someone cycle the key for you, look around, you'll see stains around those fuel areas if you have a problem or if someone's done a repair like that, which is just horrible. So thank you very much, have a nice day.